Welcome back everyone to another video. Kobak here and for this one I'm going to be doing a pet spotlight on the Tongue Lasher. Tongue Lasher is a pretty cool pet. <coughs> you get it from uh, Island Expeditions or you can get it off the auction house. It is kind of an expense. I paid like 15k for mine. But um, it is a pretty cool pet. It's got a pretty cool, unique ability called Krog Wasp Wrath. It's an AoE, and it'll swap um, your opponent's pet out for the lowest health pet they have. Uh, let's see here. Oh, and for this first team, I got a uh, clone dance with it. <coughs> Using the Terra Claw Hatchling. That's not a pet that you see very often. Oh, you ran the dodge. No heal for you, buddy. But yeah, it is a uh, SS breed frog. It's basically like Trag the Curious, except he's got more attack power and less health. But um, he's a pretty cool pet, I'd have to say. So I figured I'd give him a try. Just got him today. Been eager to get my hands on him. Oh, damn. That hurt. Like a lot. Oh, man. Oh, man. That hurt really badly. Oh goodness me, that Hawkeye is going very well for you, buddy. Hopefully I can get a crit right here, that'd be pretty nice. Aw, oh, dang it. Well, a crit was still pretty good. Um, it's probably going to haunt me or something, so I'll go ahead and go for Temporal Anomaly. Yep predictions for days boom boom uh... if he brings in the mechanical i can get down cyclone before he throws out his decoy okay here we go it's got bombing run okay interesting interesting just gonna use breath basically pretty much dead anyway decoy will go down immediately looking pretty good dragon racial uh, I might get a couple hits with cyclone too dragon racial cyclones pretty damn good look at that um go for a uh, breath again oh goodbye racial goodbye racial Alright, um, trying to think here. Looking really damn good. I forgot about Haunt's uh, nerf. Look at how little health he has. Damn, son. Okay, I'll swap in his lowest pet. But watch this, watch this. It's an AoE. See, bam. And now it'll swap in his lowest pet so it will bring in his Ghastly Kid. Oh, that cyclone. Doing the absolute work. I'll go ahead and take him down right here. And I am looking absolutely fantastic for this battle. <laughs> he went for a heal. How funny. <clears throat> Alrighty. And I'm still faster than them. For two more turns. So. Yeah. I'll go for a tentacle slap, yeah, tentacle slap right here, and then a squeeze will finish the job. Boom, boom, nicely done. Alrighty, uh, let's hop into another one. I did put a all aquatic team together for him. So we'll see how this one goes. So the move set you really want to run on uh, the Tongue Lasher is obviously Tongue Lash because he's an SS breed. Um, I recommend just sticking with Super Sticky Goo because Toxic Skin kind of sucks, but it could be situa uh, situationally good. And um, you definitely want Krogwa's Wrath. It's a pretty good ability. Pretty good. I 
Alrighty, an all aquatic team as well. Uh, let's see who prevails. Um, let's see. I guess I'll start out with Tongue Lasher, I suppose. It will bring in the Mud Jumper. I'll go ahead and switch them out. Because I don't want to really deal with uh, blood in the water right now. And now to go into some tongue lashes. Oh, he's got a pump going. Okay. Um, I'll go into Inky. Because if he's just going to be doing pumps all day, I can just uh, blinding poison him or dive. Let's see if he goes for it right now. Alright, sure did. I'll go ahead and set up Tentacle Stab. It is considered a dot, so, um... He does take less damage to it, but there is a 10% chance of taking extra damage. Let's see if I can get him to blow another pump. Oh, I totally did. Damn, good job, Inky. Oh, but he's for sure gonna hit me with a, uh, a pump right here, so... Yeah. Oh wait, no. Maybe he's not. Let's go for blinding poison. Oh. <laughs> oh, I didn't think he would have gone for another mudslide. Poor buddy. Your best bet may be to swap or something. Because, I mean, all I have is really a tentacle stab. <sighs> Unfortunately, that's all I can really spam. Okay, so there goes Inky. The only pet Hydrolink's faster than is a uh, Chuck. Go in the Tongue Lasher. Okay. I'll be able to take him down right here. His lashes hit pretty hard, I'd have to say. He is squishy, though, so uh, keep that in mind. Alright, I think I'm just going to try and do as much damage uh, as I can to Mojo. Okay, that's a dot. I'll take, like, considerably low damage from it. If I can take down Mojo with a uh, Tongue Lasher, then... Should have absolutely no problem with Hydrolin going up against Chuck. And he can't swap out neither. Because of a uh, mudslide. So I'm just going to spam Tongue Lash like no tomorrow. Really would love to get a, a, a triple hit. He's got Tongue Lash himself. Oh, come on. Get me a triple. There you go, buddy. Got it. One more tongue lash will take out Mojo. And now all there's left is Chuck. <coughs> Let's see. Krogwell's Wrath. This does have the potential to do more damage. I'll just go for it anyway. Get that up. Wait, what? Oh no. No, it's one it's one of those abilities that'll bug out on you. Wow. That sucks. Well, I'm gonna go for shell armor now because as long as I have it up, he can't apply a bleed to me. He might go for a surge right here. Thinking that I'm going to uh shell armor. It wouldn't be a bad idea. Nope, he didn't. Okay. Alright, nice. So I have a couple turns. As long as he can't apply up his thing, he only has that 50% chance to hit me. <laughs> Two damage. <laughs> uh, oh, come on, Tail Slap. Hit a little harder than that. There you go. Alright, well, one more Tail Slap will get a job done. I'm faster than him, so he won't get off blood in the water. And there we go. 
Cool beans. Alright, I have another team that I made. Let me find it. Called Sticky Tongues. It's uh, pairing him up with the Shimmering Aquafly. No real explanation as to why it goes it goes so well with aquatic types and then the spirit crab with his rod. So yeah. It's basically like my one tracked curious team, except it's got the tongue lasher in it. Alright, all beast types. Thankfully he does not have the SS breed roast high pants, so my tongue lasher um actually outspeeds him. So I will start out with him. Um go ahead and swap you out, buddy, because I don't really want to deal with uh, that stuff right there. But that's kind of weird. It bugged out whenever it should have done the full, um, or wait, it says 375 split across. Maybe it just does, um, like that one third of damage regardless of the pit that's in. I'm not sure, or maybe it's just bugging out. I honestly do not know. Go for another tongue lash. Ooh, I was kind of hoping for a um triple hit. Okay. Kind of figured he might have done that, so gives me time to go into my bird, heal up, as well as heal my little froggy back there. He can't hit me this uh this turn with any damaging abilities okay cool just gonna use alpha strike he might go for um blinding poison in which case i could just dodge if i need be yep okay let's dodge it up <coughs> dut, 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 dodge it up go for alpha strikes and I will take out this Rose Taipan before he can do anything to me. Alright. Alright, let's try and take out Kovac as quickly as I can before he can really set up a whole lot. Oh, he's got Digest Brains. Not Pheromones. Okay. Uh, he went straight for Puncture Wound before setting up his... uh poison thing. Interesting. You would have done more damage, buddy. If you would have just set that one thing up first. Okay, he's probably going to go for die just brains right here. So I'm just going to keep up the attack. Going to go ahead and do my heal. And then go for a dodge because he's probably going to go for puncture wound. And then just spam alpha strike. Such a great tier 1 bird, honestly. Basically just replaces the terra claw. I'm surprised people don't really go out to get this thing. <sighs> Such a good pet. And yeah, I was going to win that no matter what. Alright, let's uh let's go back to Jelly Bellies. I also today went and got Azariti. Paid ten K for him. Pretty cool pet. I might try him out. He's got this pretty cool uh ability as a right spike. It's basically like like a version of Ghostly Bite, except it's an elemental ability. But it doesn't have that stun factor, obviously. Alright, it's this guy again, except he went and got himself a toddle. My Cyclone is going to absolutely tear his team apart. Like, no joke. And, uh, Tongue Lasher is already faster than all of them. 
by default except uh, Chuck's Chuck when he uses a uh, surge so I don't have to worry about that neither so really I don't need to use temporal anomaly he is sure taking his time choosing an ability buddy just go for that rip wow okay Alright, there. Whoa! <laughs> he went for the yellow and he totally landed it. Wow. Okay then. <sighs> Chuck is basically the biggest threat to the team, really. Once he's gone, then I'll have like no issues with the others. Pretty cool to see Toddle though. I'm not sure if that little uh, glitch with Shell Rush still uh, works. Where, um, if Toddle is the last pet alive and you use Shell Rush, it would like uh, glitch out the game and basically nobody would win. But I'm not sure if they fixed it or not. But uh, yeah, he ran off. I was going to win that. Um. Let's go and do sticky tongues. Let's try it one more time. Alrighty. Ooh, an emperor crab. Um, I'm gonna start out with Tongue Lasher because he might start out with Warbot. Nope, he did not. Going to Shimmering Aquafly. All right, buddy. I'm just gonna use Alpha Strike. Oh, he's running the heal this time around. Okay. Um. Guess I'll go into Spirit Crab then. Set up Amplified Magic and just go into Surges because it will not only do strong damage to him, but he won't get off the extra hit with Alpha Strike. So let's go ahead and do that. Surge it up. Sur 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 surge it up. <coughs> oh, <laughs> oh, that crit was too good. Stupid Terra Claw Hatchling. Uh, nobody likes you. Um, let's go into the Tongue Lasher. Go for a Tongue Lash, because he might go for an extra plating right here. Or swap out, okay. I'm glad I went for Tongue Lash. And unless if the this freaking gets a triple hit. Yeah, you would have lived with two health, but good, you got the triple hit, Bert. Beautiful little frog. Alright, the Emperor Crab is really what's going to give me trouble. I'm going to go for Krogwa's Wrath. Because I really don't want to deal with it right now. Getting some nice triple hits though. Oh, even two crits! Holy moly! Wow. Oh, that rocket was in vain, my friend. Oh, it was absolutely in vain. 
What are you doing? She's just done like missile or something. I'm really trying to like wait out the mines at this point. Oh, he's got renewing mist. Okay, well that makes it a hell of a lot easier on me. Because if his other heal would be a lot better. Alright, nice. I was able to outweight that. Go into Shimmering Aquafly. <coughs> and I guess just spam Alpha Strike. He's going to have to renew his um, his heal and his shell shield. So that's time that he has to take. Less time for him to uh, deal damage. It's pretty much over. There is no way he's going to be able to take down his team. Even though he is interrupting my uh, alpha strike. Not allowing me to get that extra damage. Slowly but surely, he's getting taken down. <clears throat> Alright, so he's probably going to renew his heal. Gonna go into Amplify Magic and just surge away. I can't believe he's freaking living this long. Holy shite. It's absolutely insane. <laughs> oh man. Stop it! <laughs> Stop it, Emperor Crab! Stop doing this! Come on, go for a surge. Hoping he goes for a surge. Come on! What did you do? Rage quit or something? Come on! Do something! Are you absolutely joking? Oh my goodness. I disconnected in a freaking pack battle. Oh my god. Seriously, that is so bullshit. That is so damn stupid. Oh my god. <sighs> Just a second, let me get back in guys. Oh my god. Well, that sucks. So, um, for some reason the internet is just disconnected. I have no idea why. 
Pardon my French, but that's just straight up fucking stupid. That is so bullshit. Because I was easily going to win that. So uh, I guess I'll just cut it here, guys. I'm sorry about that. But, uh, yeah. Tongue Lasher. Pretty great pet. I'd recommend going to get it. As always, if you have any suggestions on what you want to see next, feel free to let me know down below. This is Kovac, and I will see you guys in the next one.